और आज का टॉपिक है म्यूटेशन म्यूटेशन मींस सडन हेरिटेबल चेंज इन जेनेटिक मटेरियल ऑफ ऑर्गेनिज्म म्यूटेशन किसे कहते हैं सडन हेरिटेबल चेंज इन जेनेटिक मटेरियल ऑफ ऑर्गेनिज्म दिस म्यूटेशन इज द सोर्स ऑफ डिसकंटिन्यूस वेरिएशन दिस म्यूटेशन इज द सोर्स ऑफ डिसकंटिन्यूस वेरिएशन दिस वर्ड म्यूटेशन वॉज फर्स्ट ऑब्जर्व बाय सेट राइट दिस म्यूटेशन फर्स्ट ऑब्जर्व बाय सेट राइट इन शॉर्ट लैग शीप कॉल्ड एनकॉन कॉल्ड एनकॉन द डिटेल्ड स्टडी ऑफ म्यूटेशन या द वर्ड म्यूटेशन वॉज गिवन बाई होगो डी राइस द वर्ड म्यूटेशन वॉज गिवन बाई होगो डी राइस एंड ही स्टडी द प्लांट कॉल्ड इवनिंग प्राइम रोज ही स्टडी द प्लांट called evening prime rose and the scientific name of this evening prime rose is oenothera lemarkiana the scientific name of this is oenothera lemarkiana germinal cell germplasm if there is a effect in germplasm or germinal cell then it is heritable then it is heritable if there is influences or effect in somatoplasm it is not heritable but in case of vegetatively propagated plant in case of vegetatively propagated plant it will be heritable again listen if effect occurs in germplasm then it will be heritable and if it occurs in somatoplasm then it is non heritable but in case of vegetatively propagated plant it is heritable now induced mutation the term induced mutation was given by bidley and totem who gave one enzyme one one gene one enzyme hypothesis also he studied neurospora this neurospora this neurospora is called drosophila drosophila of plant kingdom of plant kingdom drosophila is also called plant kingdom he took wild neurospora which was autotrophic and capable capable to grow because all the essential nutrients was formed in it listen he took wild neurospora which was autotrophic and capable to grow because they have all the essential nutrients which are necessary to grow when uv rays passed he developed a mutant neurospora it was oxotrophic and not able to grow and not able to grow because they have lost genes which were necessary for the preparation of essential nutrients so it is not able to grow again listen mutant neurospora they our oxotrophic and they are not able to grow why because the gene which was present here and which was necessary to prepare the essential nutrients they are lost due to uv rays this is called uh, uh, that is why it is not able to grow and they are not capable to grow ah uh, the another important investigation and discovery is 
new variety of wheat now india is self dependent and a good supplier of wheat to the other countries good exporter because it is only due to the effort of ms swami nathan who is also called father of green revolution in india he developed induced variety of wheat a good variety of wheat to produce more like pusa larma like sharbati sonara like panth nagar etc etc the this induced mutation is used only to grow a good variety to fulfill the need of the country and to need of the alarming peoples person populations ms swaminathan he is known as father of indian green revolution he developed gama garden in iari iari means indian agricultural research institute indian agricultural research institute it this question may be asked in any type of competitive examinations uh, and the headquarter of this institute is located at new delhi this is also called pusa institute similarly other uh, vegetables and uh, corns and you may say grains food grains are developed by this induced mutation in the last next lecture i will discuss about the types of mutations on the different basis and different ground i hope that this lecture will be liked by you subscribed by you and shared by you thank you